Hello friends, today we are hanging out in Hill City at the Beer Gardens at Lost Cabin Beer Company. We're hanging out with Jesse, he's one of the founders. Now, y'all know they have a place in Rapid City, but we're gonna check out the Hill City location. Yeah, so uh, about seven years ago, Tom uh, Silbernagel and myself, we were both avidly home brewing, and the hobby kind of turned into more of an obsession, and I think we had 16 taps on his garage going at one time, so we decided it wasn't a hobby anymore, and we needed to either do something with it or dial it way back. So we ended up opening the brewery in Rapid City in 2016, and. Been kind of off to the races since then. Uh, summer 2023, uh, early July here, we opened up and been great. We really excited, really excited about the space. We have a huge outdoor space, and so we've been doing a lot of events and uh, beer releases, and now excited to kind of be in the hills. So on the bypass through Hill City, we're right between the 1880 train and Tracy Park, which is the Mickelson Trailhead. The brewery sits right on the Mickelson, so. Historically, it's worked out pretty well for us being next to a bike path and a bike shop. We got bikes and boat rentals here next door, and no, it's been been great. A lot of traffic off the trail and a lot of local support so far. With concerts and yoga in the garden on Sunday mornings. We have food trucks rotating through, so a lot of exciting things happening up here. We got yard games and cornhole. Uh, so we're still brewing in Rapid City. We have our uh, production facility in our tap room with a brewery in Rapid City, so that's where all the beer's getting made. But we have 15 taps rotating up here, and. You know, a big selection of NAs and rotating some guest beers in as well. Yeah, everything from sours to IPAs to stouts and light beers, you know, so hopefully something for, you know, every kind of drinker. So our beer is available statewide and into a little bit of Wyoming as well. We have, you know, a great crew of people that surround us. We, we have an awesome staff that really cares about what they're producing and the people they're serving it to. And we've just had an overwhelming amount since day one of, of local support and, uh, you know, enthusiasm about what we're doing. So we, you know, we're very fortunate and couldn't be more thankful. And we always have events going on. We always have uh, live music rotating between the two tap rooms. So the best place to check that out is on our Facebook or Instagram or at lostcabin.beer. When we started, I think we were the third brewery in Rapid City at the time, but now there's eight or nine in Rapid City and, and more on the way. So just an exciting community to be a part of, an exciting industry to, to, uh, to work in.